Hey, what's up? It's uh, Jake and Amir here. <laughs> oh, we're two jacked dudes that happen to make fucking nerdy internet videos. Yeah. It's Wednesday, January 30th. And we just saw that there was a script on the Jake and Amir subreddit, reddit.com slash r slash Jake and Amir. And it looked like it was funny. I started reading it and I thought it would be funny if Jake and I read it for the first time sort of like a table read we acted it out as we were reading it for the first time on video this is so this is Jake and Amir Father's Day script by Brenner 14 <clears throat> You want to read the scene directions? Oh yeah so Amir enters throws down a heavy stone tablet onto his desk You've got to be kidding me man Top 5 Father's Day gift ideas So no more scrolls then You know it's February right By Micah Valerie no, Stop Perwitz no. Blumenfeld <laughs> Picking up my phone. You know what? You've just gone. You've gone too far this time. Fast five. Looking for a gift guaranteed to enthrall and appall? Take the old man to Sky Mall. That's right. A starlight projector for that cowardly defector will have him wishing he'd been a better protector. <laughs> well, that or will hate it so much that he freaking moves. Win win. Nah. Twin grin. Hey, mom. It's uh, it's Jake. Listen, I think we're gonna have to go ahead with that whole uh, restraining order thing we talked about before. Uh, yeah. For Micah. Number four. Shopping's a chore. But don't you fret. Do some quick shopping for your mad, bad, deadbeat dad. And then Jet. So this is so this is about your dad. Your dad, specifically. Where did you even find the tools necessary to carve these words into this prehistoric <laughs> tablet? Run from, this, run from store to store, <laughs> toppling over whatever signs and displays you can find before settling on the one gift that keeps him from taking nothing. It's twice as much fun as a tie and half the price. Sure, you've got his jeans, but that don't mean you should spend any of that sweet, sweet green. Help I me. I know. I'm sorry, too, but he made another one of those lists, and I think it's just for the best at this point. Jake. Hey, Jake. Uh, was it clear that I was talking about weed in the last bit, or should I go back to the old clawing board? Woof. It wasn't clear at all, mainly because I can't think of a single store that accepts drugs as currency. Also, you definitely shouldn't be spending half the price of a tie on nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Number P. <laughs> so bad. It's a bad joke. Finally, give your dad the one thing he's always asked for. Sure, you've tried to deny it, but it's high time you try it. Write him a note and wrap, it around, wrap that belt around your throat. Pull up a chair and say your last prayer. Breathe, breathe that last deep breath yeah, Listen, of, Mom, I gotta go. Hey, buddy, enough. Really, <laughs> enough. I'm not quite finished with the list, though. Just forget the list, man, all right? Are you trying to tell me something? <laughs> just, I worked really hard on it, and I wanted you to hear it, okay? Fine, just tell me quickly, then. What are the last two things? Well, Terrible 2 is a broken rice cooker from Sky Mall that you found in a trash heap, and one is... Kill yourself. Listen, <laughs> listen, I think I think we should both go talk to Paul, all right? See what kind of health insurance you've got. Find out maybe if we can, you know, find you somebody to talk to. About the list? Like a copy editor or something? Sure. Yeah. Come on. All right, let me take this list with me. Amir heaves the list off the desk. Is that written in hieroglyphics? Cuneiform, actually. As they walk away, Missouri curator enters the office with a police officer. Curator pointing at Amir. There he is, officer. There's the vagrant who's been stealing our scrolls. They finally caught us, Jake. Scramble! Amir drops the tablet on Jake's foot and flees. Ow! Fuck! And cut. 